Hi, this is Shalini, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can do uh, the EFT shortcut tapping technique. Okay, and EFT stands for Emotional Freedom Techniques. And to know more about EFT, please uh, visit my website www.eftthailand.com. So before we start, um, it's a good idea to have a paper and pencil pen ready. And it's also a good idea to have some water, drinking water, a glass of water. Okay, uh, it's something we recommend as you do the EFT tapping. Okay, so you can pause the video and get whatever you need to. Um, now that you have what you need, let's get to it. So in the basic EFT tapping technique, the first thing you want to do is you want to think of what is the problem that you want to clear, that you want to let go of. It could be something physical, it could be something emotional. So if you have that piece of paper, you know, you want to write down what it is that you want to deal with. Is it a stiff neck, something physical, a, a lower back pain, a cold, a sore throat, you know, or is it something emotional? Is it uh, anger, frustration, you know, uh, resentment, uh, annoyed feelings so write down on that piece of paper what it is that's the problem what it is that's bothering you and then the second thing you want to do is on a, on a scale of 0 to 10 give yourself a number um, as to the intensity of the problem so for example, if I'm angry about something, then on a scale of 0 to 10, how angry am I feeling? Is it 10? Really, really mad? 0 is, I don't feel any anger. So give yourself the intensity. How intense is that problem on a scale of 0 to 10? Whether it's a physical problem or an emotional one. So go ahead and give yourself a number. Okay, and that's Basically, the significance of doing this is to sort of have a guideline so that we know, did anything shift after we've done the tapping? So it's just a guideline for yourself to see, did the number shift? Did I, does it feel less intense now? Okay? So the third part is the setup phrase. And what we do in the setup phrase is basically we address the problem and we do this on the karate chop point okay hopefully you've seen my other video on all the EFT tapping points um, the karate chop point is right here and so the setup phrase goes something like this you tap continuously on the karate chop and then you say this phrase which is even though I have this problem, I deeply and completely accept myself. And we say this three times. Even though I have this problem, I deeply and completely accept myself anyway. Even though I have this problem, I deeply and completely accept myself anyway. So that's the setup phrase. And you know, you want to, um, when, when you say this problem, you just want to focus on what's your specific problem. So the problem could be something physical, the problem could so be something emotional, okay? And then the next part is the reminder phrase. And the reminder phrase is basically a phrase that reminds us that keeps us in tune and focus with the issue that we're addressing and so I'm just gonna use a general phrase phrase right now which is the problem um, and tap on these points so the reminder phrase is this problem tapping on the eyebrow point 
this problem this problem this problem this problem this problem this problem and then back to the top of the head this problem and we take a deep breath and we release so that's the first you know the the first basic tapping round so let's say for example maybe I have a cold how would I work this or if maybe if I had a stiff neck uh, you want to be really specific with what the problem is so let's say I have a stiff neck and how would I do the tapping now so I'd go to the you know to the setup phrase at first I'd think of my problem the stiff neck I'd give myself a rate on a scale of 0 to 10 or oh, it's like about a 6 okay and then I do the tapping and I say even though I have the stiff neck I deeply and completely accept myself so instead of the problem I've just substituted it for the problem that I'm having right now which is a stiff neck so we say this phrase three times this is the second time even though I have the stiff neck I deeply and completely accept myself third time even though I have this stiff neck I deeply and completely accept myself. Now I'm going to do the reminder phrase. The stiff neck. This stiff neck. This stiff neck. This stiff neck. This stiff neck. The stiff neck. The stiff neck. the stiff neck and take a deep breath so now I'm going to go and check in and see how does that stiff neck feel right now after one round of tapping so if on a scale of 0 to 10 it was a 6 maybe it's completely gone maybe it's gone down from 6 to a 2 maybe it's, it's just completely gone so if it's gone that's great and if it's not gone you want to do the second round of tapping okay and to watch the second round please go to the the other video EFT shortcut tapping technique part 2 and see how that's done okay well that's the basic EFT tapping technique